Each Explore and Describe visual arts lesson includes time for students to work independently. While your students are working as artists, we encourage you to use the Observation and Support Tool for Visual Arts to help you notice the variety of ways young artists choose to work during their independent art making time. In this video, we'll focus on noticing the choices that students might make about how they use their body and their space. Notice all the different ways your students are making choices about how they use their body and position themselves in the classroom space. Artists of all ages will position their body in different ways in relationship to what they are making, taking into consideration what they prefer or what is available to them. The artists in your classroom may be sitting, kneeling, standing, or working on the rug. Sometimes, students continue to embody ideas throughout the visual art making process. Sometimes, students just need to wiggle or move their bodies while they're working. These kids are planning to draw a basketball court today, and they're taking a moment to explore their ideas kinetically while their teacher passes out the paper. In the background, you can see other children who are working without moving or embodying. Both ways of working are valid. You may notice that your students will use and engage with their materials in a variety of ways. Artists decide how to keep their workspaces based on what works for them and their process. They often share spaces with each other, so they have to navigate a studio system that works for everyone. Similarly, your classroom can feel like an art studio. Students can keep their materials in their workspace in a way that works for their process, but that is also respectful of others. Create a classroom environment where students feel free to use their bodies and the classroom space in service of their artistic process.